welcome to my scope. Good morning. It's really beautiful out here. You know, I don't know if you can see from here. Anyway, I'm going to start my scope here. Good morning to you all. I'm going to take you outside, of course. Sounds like my dogs are home. Did my dogs make it home, Fuzzy? Okay, this is Homer, Alaska. It's beautiful here. My dogs made it home. I live in Homer. Oh, there they are. <laughs> hey. Okay. Now this is Homer, Alaska on the Kenai Peninsula. Um, I'm not sure if anyone's here because it's not showing me if anyone's here. But uh, it's quite a pretty morning. I wanted to tell you what I'm doing. Uh, I have a girlfriend named Melanie and we've got an oil team who's ready to start a cleanse for the spring to help our bodies be healthier. That's our goal. And to be honest with you, um, not so sure about um, doing these things again. It seems like my day life routine is always the next thing to do to better my health, but it it, uh, it gets a little bit um, old. So I mean, I'm not 20 anymore. So the experimenting phase has kind of changed from 20 to 30 to 40 and now in my 50s I just can see a difference in my responses and how I want to be as a person I I've done every diet I I had I I teach Zumba I'm AFA certified for group fitness I I've um, learned all sorts of educational things on on health so anyways I am um, I wanted to show you what I'm going to be doing, and I do think that this is a wonderful thing to add to your life, to just have a lifestyle change that's healthy and good for you. I know it is for me. I'm truly looking forward to it. Um, we start on Monday. So, I got a few things out here um, in my special little box that I got to show you. I don't know, is anybody here even? Uh, I see no hearts. Um... Oh, okay, I saw somebody said they're starting the cleanse. Two people are here. Wonderful. Okay, so I didn't have my my thing. I had to swipe up a little. So for if you asked me any questions or if you said anything nice and I missed it, I, I apologize. So, But I think I can read them now. So feel free to type something if you'd like. So you're going to start the cleanse, which I think is a wonderful thing. I'm starting the cleanse on, on Monday with my um, girlfriend, Melanie. And um, I wanted to show you a, a few of the products that we're doing. So um, this is the Slim and Sassy Metabolic Blend. Now, um, this is really nice to have it in a pill form because you just have to like um, put them in your pocket and you can have them anywhere with you. It's, it's a little bit more simpler. I stick it right in my sweatshirt pocket and I like to do that um, four times a day to five times a day. Here's the oil as well. Any of you guys have heard about this special blend? There's some really neat things you can do with this that I just love. Um, one of them, one of the things I love to do is, um, is uh, yeah, me too, I just love it. I um, uh, like to do the wraps. So if you haven't tried the wraps, um, what I do is I take fractionated coconut oil and then I add, I, I put a, uh, like, let's say a quarter of a cup or just a good amount in a cup. And then I add about 10 drops to it and I slather myself up. And then I use um, uh, uh, gauze first. Um, oh, no. Yeah, gauze first. And then I add the plastic wrap over the top. That's right. And um, it, it, you use it, sleep in it overnight and see if you notice changes. I know it's moving water and moving and distributing things because I measure and I can tell that something's happening. So I have my enzymes that I'm going to be starting to take for my cleanse. 
I also bought, and I've never tried, um, the GX Assist. So I'll be using that as well on this cleanse. And also the PB Assist. This is the probiotic, which I highly recommend. I think um, last time when I started to take this, I really noticed some uh, good benefits. And I think you will as well. So... Um, Last but not the list, least, I have the Zendocrine. And um, I keep saying um, and it's really bugging me. <laughs> um, <laughs> Zendocrine um, is a combination that helps support um, your body's like liver functions and kidney functions. You can rub it right directly on your body, but I plan to ingest this one. Only doTERRA would you ever do that, but I plan to. Um, ingest this so. but some of you know that when you start exercise and um, eating and uh, eating well and exercising um, you'll have aches and muscle pain work right through that I'm not saying hurt yourself but I'm saying push yourself and um, again doTERRA has products for that um, I'm in love with this stuff deep blue rub it's great and feel free to put this on any areas that are bug bugging you, your knees, your ankles, any of your joints that are hurting. Um, I've had my mom who's had sore joints, and oh, and my father, both of them, um, enjoy this rub. This rub is awesome. Okay, lastly but not least, let's just talk about what you're going to eat or what I'm going to eat um, coming, up, coming this week. So people like to be on a diet, right? Because they're like, I need a structure. I need to just eat bananas or whatever diets do that make people feel like they need to be on them. I, um, but I really wanted to talk to you about lifestyle and trying to eat the things that you know are good for you. I know one thing I've learned is I try to practice to stay away from white things. So I use the color white. And I tell myself, eh, if it's white, not so nice. And I put it aside. So you can think about what's white. Um, there's potatoes, there's sugars, there's breads. Um, those are the type of things that I've been trying to really tell myself it's not so good. And so if it's green, then it's lean. And I tell myself, eat the green. So um, I even drink green juice. I mean, it's crazy, but it's really true. I really um, feel like uh, look for the colors that are happy, live colors. And put them in your life. Put those colors in your life. Um, uh, this I got at Costco. Now, mind you, I live in Homer, Alaska, and I just got back from a trip, so I got to go to Costco. And I love stuff like this. Just a big bag with greens. Now, you might say, oh, that's too big. And I'm, and I'm going to tell you, no, it's not. Use these greens. Use them. I mean, they work in eggs. You can uh, mix, stir up an omelet. You can use them in your blender for smoothies. You can use them in your soups. Make a soup. Throw in the greens. Um, and you can cook with them like you, the traditional ways of eating it, you know, on your plate. It's a single serving. But anyways, use those greens. Um, the other thing I want to tell you, I live in Alaska, so my sons are commercial fishermen for salmon. Lucky me, I know. Alaska wild salmon, Alaska wild halibut. I love those. But I mean, you guys can get this at the grocery store. Um, don't be shy to get this at the grocery store. And, you know, there's a lot of ways you can cook it. But I highly recommend you use your grill. Just put it on the grill. You don't have to add all the extras, all the extra sauces. Just grilled salmon is delicious. Little fresh lemon. Oh, my gosh. It's great. So, my husband's a hunter. I know you guys might know that I live in Alaska. So, I mean, I've even, I mean... Not everybody has a leaf head above them. See that? <laughs> so, anyway, I know I live in Alaska and I have a husband that's a hunter. But um, So, I have fresh organic meats. I highly re recommend organic meat. 
Um, my husband went elk hunting this year, so we have some nice elk hunting, elk meat in our freezer. So, but um, if you don't have access, which I don't expect the average American to just go hunting, um, go to the grocery store, look in the organic section, um, try to stay away from processed, try to stay away from anything that's going to have hormones in it, and um, see if you notice a change for, the, for your cleanse. Um, I'll be, I'll be scoping more on Monday, but at my scopes, you most, most people know my scopes are about Alaska. I run a bed and breakfast here, and I love to share about the moose and my dogs and the eagles and the, whatever I see. But, um, you guys today are getting me on a day where I'm starting my cleanse this week. So I'm thinking a little different and I'm sharing what I'm thinking. And I think about my life. And I have to be really honest, like I said, I'm not 20 or 30 or 40 anymore. And uh, I have to look at myself and say, you know, you've tried a lot of things. What do you know? What have you learned? What have you learned through your years? And I think what I've learned is the key is balance and moderation. Don't be afraid to try new things, add new things to your life. Don't be afraid to do things different. So anyways... I hope that it was a little bit of an inspiration to you, and have a great day, everyone. I'll be talking to you soon. Bye now.